Welcome back to my channel, my name is Mariel and today I'm going to show you even more Dark Academia inspired outfits and this time I'm going to make them more suitable for fall. So I really hope you like these outfits and if you do, then like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Instagram at the Dress Relief and on TikTok at Dress Relief if you want to see even more outfit ideas and fashion content and let's get started. Okay, so I've had this outfit idea for a while now and I've been waiting for the fall to arrive with the cooler weather so I can try it out and I really like it. I know it gives off a little bit of berries and creams vibe, but I think I'm a pretty cute little lad. Berries and cream, berries and cream, I'm a little lad who loves berries and cream. So I'm wearing this white blouse with some pretty loose kind of puff sleeves and it actually doesn't have a collar so I added on this fake frilly collar and then I threw on a black sweater vest over it and paired it with some black pleated trousers and paired that with my black lace up boots. I think it's a really great look for the fall with the sweater vest and the long pants and these pants are pretty roomy so you can easily layer some tights or leggings underneath and maybe even layer a long sleeve under here although it is a 3-4 sleeve so you might have to push up the long sleeve a, a bit or you could just throw a coat on and I think it works well for cooler weather. So next I have this cute little pleated skirt number. I have on this white turtleneck layered over this argyle style plaid cardigan and then I also have on this cute little pleated brown corduroy skirt, some brown tights, some cream colored leg warmers, and some white sneakers. Of course you could wear some nude tights or no tights at all if it's pretty warm where you live. I don't know what the weather's like where you are. And yeah, I think it's a really cutesy, soft girl kind of academia vibe. Also you guys, I'm kind of upset because I bought these tights months ago and I barely opened the package just now and realized it came with a rip. But I'm pretty sure I'm past the date to return them so I guess I'll have to deal with it. Next, in an elaborate display of originality, I'm wearing the exact same outfit but with brown pants instead of a brown skirt. Of course, again, you can always layer more underneath the pants. You could wear some tights or leggings. You can wear another long sleeve shirt under here um, and just make it suitable for cooler weather. You can add a coat or just wear it as is. So this outfit for some reason feels very take core to me for my BTS ARMY fans out there. You're not gonna understand! It's BTS! It's BTS ARMY! Although pretty much all Dark Academia outfits kind of fit that aesthetic. And so I'm wearing the same brown trousers again and the white sneakers, although I think you could switch it out for other Dark Academia shoes such as lace up boots or Oxfords or Mary Janes or even a little neutral colored heel. And I paired this outfit with this cable knit sweater and I think it would also look cute with a little turtleneck peeking out if you want to add another layer underneath. Alright then. So this is an outfit obviously for a more warmer fall day. I have on this white t-shirt, this black pleated skirt, and this black sweater vest. And I wore just this part of the outfit in my previous video on college majors as outfits, which is a really great video. You should definitely check it out if you haven't already. But I also added on this plaid blazer to make it more suitable for fall. And you can also wear a long sleeve instead of a t-shirt or a turtleneck instead of a t-shirt. And of course, I paired it with my black chunky loafers again. I also imagine you could wear it with some long knee-high or thigh-high black socks to add a little extra layer on your legs if it is a little bit chillier. As you can see, I really love brown color palettes and I don't know if that's because the trendiness of the color brown has been shoved down my throat too often or I actually like it, but for whatever reason, I think this outfit is super cute. 
I have on a brown turtleneck, my brown trousers that I wore earlier, and then I have this off-white colored cardigan over the turtleneck and tucked into the trousers. And I've definitely worn some variation of this outfit a lot in the past. I think it's a very versatile outfit. Turtleneck, trousers, cardigan. It's a really easy outfit formula to have for dark academia. It works with a lot of different color schemes. So here's another color scheme variation of it. And I like wearing sneakers with this outfit just for a comfy vibe, but I think it goes with any Dark Academia shoe as well. Here I have on some beige sneakers to go with this color palette. Okay, so lots of layering going on for this bad boy. I got on my white turtleneck again, and this time layered a waistcoat over, wore my black pleated trousers again, and my chunky loafers again, and layered on my plaid blazer again. So I'm reusing a lot of the same items, but I'm making a whole completely different outfit with it, which is my favorite way to come up with outfits because it's very sustainable, it's really good to have versatile pieces in your closet, and wear each item as much as possible. Okay, my bangs are getting worse and worse as this video goes on, but whatever. So this outfit is a more feminine version of that last outfit, and I just swapped out the black pleated trousers for a black pleated skirt. Um, you can also wear some tights underneath or long socks, and it's pretty similar to the outfit I wore earlier with the black sweater vest and t-shirt, and instead I just have a white turtleneck and the waistcoat. So it's a little bit more dressed up with the waistcoat, but um, same vibe basically of that other outfit. Okay, so this is another very similar outfit, but this time I swapped out the turtleneck for an oversized button-down shirt, and I kept the waistcoat on, the black pleated skirt, the plaid blazer, but I swapped out the loafers for some black lace of boots just to spice it up a little bit, and I left the button-down shirt untucked just to show off the different layers, and I think it's my favorite of the three similar outfits versus the t-shirt and sweater vest and the white turtleneck and waistcoat look. Um, just because it's a little different with the untucked button-down shirt. Okay, so for a vaguely edgy twist on a dark academia outfit, I have this harness layered over my cable knit sweater and again have on my black pleated mini skirt. And then this time I paired it with black combat boots to match the vibe of the harness. And I think this outfit is really cute and has that slightly edgy touch to it, but you can also wear it without the harness and I think that looks cute as well for a more classic academia look. For another vaguely edgy twist on a Dark Academia outfit, I wanted to incorporate this leather cutout corset that I just got from Alexis Shan, which is a small business and they make the corsets custom made to your measurements, which I find super cool. And I've been really loving finding new small businesses to support. So if you have any other suggestions, let me know in the comments below because I'd love to check it out. And I layered this corset over my lace turtleneck and I just love the contrast between the soft, romantic, lace fabric versus the edgy leather corset and I have on my pleated trousers again and paired it again with my black lace up boots. I love the modern kind of gothic vibe to this outfit. I think it's super pretty and I I just love this corset so much. I'm really happy with this purchase. I definitely recommend checking out Alexis Shan.
finally, we have more of a smart, casual, dark academia look. I have on my lace turtleneck again, and I really love the lace turtleneck as just a little step up from a normal white turtleneck. I think it's so pretty and it spices up an outfit a little bit more rather than a basic turtleneck. And I took that into some white leg jeans and I paired it again with my black lace up boots. And then I threw on a plaid blazer again for more of that dark academia touch. Thank you so much for watching. Again, I really hope you liked these outfits. And if you did, like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Instagram at the Dress Relief and on TikTok at Dress Relief. Let me know what videos you want to see in the future. And I'll see you guys next time.